In this video, we will see how you can transfer your complete data from Android to a new iPhone. It might be your contacts, messages, your photos or your WhatsApp data in a very easy manner. Hey guys, welcome Technical Beardo here. If you're new here, then please like the video and please do subscribe. So now let's start the video here. So now talking about the process, before that there are few points you need to follow them or make sure that they are done. The first thing, make sure your both the devices, your Android and your iPhone are enough charged or they have enough battery for the process. Okay. Secondly, make sure that the iPhone is not set up. It should be completely new just like a box piece where the setup screen appears for the process. In a simple words, we get a hello screen for a setup initially, right? The same screen should be or a same condition your iPhone should be in. And if you already set up your iPhone, then what you can do, you can erase your iPhone manually by going to settings, going to general, tap on transfer or reset iPhone and here just click on erase all content and settings and you can erase your phone just by entering your Apple ID password and PIN code. Okay, erase that and your iPhone should be in new setup mode or a new condition mode. And the third point is that you should enable Wi-Fi on your Android phone that is required for your transfer. Okay, now all the points are checked in. Now let's add the process here. And now here for the process, the first thing is that go ahead on your Android phone and download the application called Move to iOS. Go ahead, do that. Once you have the application, now the second thing that is your iPhone. Okay, take your iPhone and here start setting up your iPhone by following on-screen instruction until you reach a screen called Transfer Apps and Data. Okay, come here and here you will see regarding options, multiple options for transferring your data, okay, or restoring your data. So from here, just go ahead and tap on from Android. Once you tap on that, take your Android phone and here open the Move to iOS application and here click on Continue. And also it will ask for a various permission here, grant a permission on Android phone and click on Continue here. And also on iPhone, go ahead and click on Continue. Once you click on continue, here you'll see one code and similar code will be asked on your Android. So just go ahead, take your Android phone and just enter the code here and just authenticate the transfer. Once you enter the code, now comes the main screen here that is choosing the data to transfer from your contact, messages, calendar, Google account, your photos as well as your WhatsApp. Just go ahead and enable whatever you want to transfer and here it will ask for a permission, just tap on allow. Similarly, when you enable same thing for WhatsApp, first it will open an application, okay. It will make the backup ready. Now the next step, once you enable everything, go ahead and click on continue. And now here you can see that it says that transferring data to iPhone. So it will take a time depending upon what you are transferring and how much your data is. And now wait for a transfer. And now as you can see on the screen, it says that transfer complete. So keep your Android phone at a side and here just click on continue on your iPhone. And the next thing it will ask is that just enter your Apple ID and password. If you have it, enter here or else just below that, there is an option that don't have Apple ID. Just click on that and create your new Apple ID and go ahead and complete the iPhone setup here. And now, once you have your iPhone setup, if you see the contacts, they're already there. Your messages already there. Photos, I didn't do it, but photos will be there. Also, the main thing, important thing, that is your WhatsApp. If you see, there is the WhatsApp icon on the home screen. So now do one thing, go to your App Store, set up your App Store. Once you have your App Store, go ahead and download the WhatsApp on your iPhone. And once you open the WhatsApp, all your chats, all your media from WhatsApp will be available here in the WhatsApp. So guys, that's it. You saw it, how I transfer the data from Android to iPhone very easy and smoothly manner. I hope this video helped you and if you have any queries or any issues, do comment below. We'll try to answer them if possible. And guys, please like the video and please subscribe for amazing videos like this on your iPhone tips and tricks, in your iPhone solutions and your iOS update. So guys, until then, thank you very much. Bye bye. Take care. See you in the next video.